But you see, it's like, it's like this. <clears throat> Have you ever been in a tai, uh, Aikido school? No. No. Taiji school? No. Oh, okay. Taekwondo. Okay. Taekwondo school. See, when you go any, any martial art, right, <clears throat> you know, you're going to Taekwondo school, there is a culture there. There is a particular feel. Everybody is believing in a fantasy. They go in and they participate in the Tai Chi fantasy, the Tai Chi world. They believe this is a reality, see, and it's good, and it's true, see, or the Taekwondo world, see, and how to behave and how to relate and how to think. And a lot of it's quite subtle. Most people don't notice. But if you had a Tai Chi school, an Aikido school, and a Taekwondo school right next to each other, if you walked into one, it would feel different, very differently. People would act differently, they'd wear different clothes, they would behave differently, they, you know, they'd relate to you differently, blah, 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 than the Taekwondo school or the Aikido school. They'd also smell differently. But, <laughs> but see, every, every one, and you know, I started to notice over time, like every martial art, and some are more than others. Some are more fantasy, and by fantasy, what I'm saying here really is something not real. Something just put on and uh, attached to. You know, like I was saying about the spiritual practices. You see, they're, they're going around in a, in a fantasy. You see, I wear my hair this way, I do the beads that way, I make these chants, I do this, I'm going to get in light. It's a fantasy. I got to burn incense, you know, blah, blah, blah. It's a fantasy. It is, it's not true. It's just a, an image of uh, a belief system. See, it's a belief system that permeates, and everybody shares it. So if you go to an Aikido school, this is so different than a Tai Chi school, and they might say sometimes similar things here and there, See, but it's very different. Mm -hmm. And Aikidoists, basically, they all want to see themselves as samurai. See, they were the hakama. They want to strut, and they do their, ah, oh, their key flow, and they want to see themselves as spiritual samurai, in a sense, you see? It's a fantasy, because they are not. And uh, they're not even warriors. Um, you know, Tai Chi, you know, same thing. They want to see themselves as, you know, uh, Taoists or something, and into the nature, and flowing their chi, and, you know, becoming in harmony with everything, but don't pinch, don't pinch. And... <laughs> <laughs> and stuff like that, you know, you know, or they go down all kinds of different roads and stuff like that. I'm just saying, you see, it's fantasy. I'm just choosing a couple. Um, it's fantasy. So in spiritual worlds, re religion, 90% fantasy. You go into any church, any religion, what's going on in there? It's ritual, dogma, superstition, belief systems, ways of behaving. You see? Mm. Yeah. And, uh, you know, and, and, and paraphernalia, you know, certain hats and crosses or whatever, or things, this bobs and that bobs and this thing, you know, whatever, whatever the thing's about. And um, most of it's fantasy. It has nothing to do with the truth at all. Not at all. 